Hey guys, it's me, Charlie Wired, yeah, and welcome back to the video. And today, we're back with more Happy Tree Friends Graphic Foods. That's right, I'm so excited to do this, honestly, I can't wait. I pushed myself back from play from doing this because I had a lot of other stuff to do, but now I'm finally back. Oh, I'm so excited, I cannot wait to do this. So yeah, now today in this Happy Tree Graphic Food, we're going to react to Have You Played Milk Pong Yet? and YouTube Copyright School. So, I'm not sure what these are, but judging by... Um, the titles, they're going to involve some like questions that these, um, I guess these type are not asking you. There are some other things this place as well that were for these videos, but I decided to skip them and save for another time because they didn't really seem interesting to be honest. So I thought I'd react to these instead because these um, do look more interesting. So yeah, I'm doing it as, um, so I'm not doing these in order anymore, I'm just doing them in the ones I'm actually choosing to react to now. Alright, so let's go ahead and check this out shall we? So let's start off with, have you played Milk Pong yet? By the way, to answer that question, no I haven't. <laughs> but let's check it out shall we? So, let's begin. So, what's this about? Well, let's find out. So, we've got... I guess it's about Nutty and Lumpy playing Pong, by the sounds of it. Ooh. Wait, I thought he'd done it. Ooh. Ball's gone in there. Oh, no, Lumpy, don't get that out. He's not going to do it, is he? Oh, he did get it out. Oh, <laughs> They had to. Happy Tree Friends Milk Pong. So is this some sort of game? Okay, I guess I guess it is. No, I've not played before, but what the fuck? So Handy and Marble chopping the tree down, and Lumpy was there. I, I, that, that that was not what I was thinking. I thought like he was gonna put his hand in that machine and then you know chop his hand off, but no, something else happened. And yeah, that's another one of the moments where, um, the, where the mole and Handy are actually doing stuff together because yeah, they tend to do it in a lot of episodes. So there's there's another example there, and I like I like seeing that. I do I like seeing that just like how I like to see um you know Petunia have um, a relationship with Handy because <laughs> they're great together. It's my opinion. Don't disrespect it. <laughs> All right, last one to react to is YouTube copyright school. So with any further ado, let's see what this is. YouTube copyright school, and as a matter of fact, it's not played by YouTube themselves. So why why is that? <laughs> Featuring Russell and Lumpy, Russell and Lumpy. This other by YouTube themselves. Lumpy and everybody's really been looking forward to the new video from Lumpy and the Lumpets. Even Lumpy. Okay. Oh, it's unlisted as Russell's well. Russell's a huge fan. He can't wait to tell all his friends about it. Oh, he's recorded it in the cinema. Hey, Russell! You didn't create that video. You just copied someone else's content. <laughs> Uploading someone else's content without permission could get you into a lot of trouble. It may be yeah. copyright infringement. Russell's doing copyright. Copyright is a form of protection for original works of authorship, including literary, dramatic, musical, graphic, and audiovisual creations. Copyright infringement occurs when a copyrighted work is reproduced, distributed, performed, or publicly displayed without the permission of the copyright holder or the legal right to do so. Even though YouTube is a free site, you can get in serious trouble for copyright infringement. Well, there you are some things about it that are fair use, like reaction videos. For monetary damages. Like they're you fair could use, lose your but obviously recorded from Simba, that's not worse, fair use at all. You could lose your YouTube account. <laughs> you only get a few chances. If YouTube receives a valid notification of alleged copyright infringement from a copyright holder for one of your videos, the video will be removed in accordance with the law. You'll be <laughs> notified via email to email and in your account. And you'll get a strike. If YouTube finds you're a repeat offender, you'll get banned for life. Why am I watching this shit? <laughs> Honestly. Here's an idea. Why not make your own video? Make your own video. Lumpy and the Lumpets live. Uh-oh. You're making a video of Lumpy's live performance of his song which is still protected by copyright. Oh, He's come on, it's a live stage show. They got to play themselves. <laughs> oh, Russell, 
Your reuse of Lumpy's content is clever, <laughs> but I love if you Lumpy. get permission for it, <laughs> mashups or remixes of content may also require permission from the original copyright owner, depending on whether or not the use is a fair use. In the United States, copyright law allows for the fair use of copyright Russell's material. Russell's just breaking every copyright law that's fair. The owner. <laughs> Under the law, determinations of fair use take into account the purpose of the use, the nature of the copyrighted work, the amount and substantiality of the work used in relation to the work as a whole, and the effect of the use upon the potential market for the copyrighted work. Other jurisdictions may have similar copyright provisions protecting fair use or fair dealing. If you are uncertain as to whether a specific use qualifies as a fair use, you should consult a qualified copyright attorney. If someone copies your what? work after you posted it, oh, you have this the is right the video. to take it down. Oh, YouTube like to provides tools for rights holders to control the use of their content. Yeah, it's something that YTP about this um, episode if where, takes where down your by mistake was, um, or as a result of a misidentification like of the material tab, to be like removed, like a there's a video, and, 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 and Lumpy reports it, you and can send YouTube a gives notice it a that strike. there was an error. But be careful. If you misuse the process, you could end up in court. And then you would get in a lot of trouble. Shutting That's down how the law works. Is Russell gonna learn from this or not? That's more like it. Okay, By singing yes. an original song, you're creating your own content. <laughs> when you make an original video, you're the owner of your own copyright. And you have the right to post it to YouTube. Original content is what makes YouTube interesting. Start creating your own, and who knows? <laughs> your video could explode! Just like that. <laughs> it literally explodes. If you're still unsure about copyright issues, YouTube has some resources as a starting point. So For YouTube made some sales for having this year. Copyright at the bottom of every page. Wow. That's actually, um... I guess that was good. <laughs> Honestly, there, there, there is a lot of things I could literally commentate about that thing. Alright, first of all, making a reaction video to cite as an original, that's fair use. Obviously, you're allowed to do that. And you are, I guess you are somewhat allowed to make edits of, of um, you know, the original footage. Like, even YouTube said themselves, you're allowed to make, you know, edit of, a, of an original. But they still hit with copyright anyway, and you still get hit with a, um, a copyright strike. Or sometimes you get your video blocked worldwide, and you get all that crap. I mean, this is from YouTube like 12 years ago, so obviously they were, they were more um, they were more strict back then. You'll see, there wasn't like this um, blocking worldwide thing back then. There was this thing where they'll give you a copyright strike, and if you get three strikes, you're terminated. I mean, that that's still a thing today, but you're more chance, you're more likely getting a chance of it being blocked worldwide than receiving a copyright strike. I mean, an instant termination can can be rare as well sometimes, but yeah. <laughs> All I can say to that is, uh, I guess I did learn some sort of lesson about you know what what's about copyright and what isn't. Anyway guys, hope you guys enjoyed this reaction video. I know these things I got to do weren't really much, but I thought they would be interesting to do since I haven't done a Happy Tunes reaction in a long time. If you know anything Happy Tunes that really that's good for me to react to, let me know, because right now I'm on Switch or finding something to react to that's actually good and that isn't. If you could think of anything, let me know, but make sure it is Happy Tunes related, nothing else, not fucking, I don't know, other related topics that you guys mentioned, just make sure it's Happy Tunes related or <laughs> Spy related or um, whatever play related, so yeah. That's all I've got to say. I hope you guys enjoyed this reaction video. Um, what do I prefer? I don't know. Probably the ping pong ones, to be honest. I thought that was actually more interesting. So, yeah, that's all I've got to say. Um, bye bye. Peace out. And think for yourselves. <laughs>